There is one thing you should always take with you when you go out on a Saturday night. Your friends. Why are you just getting in? Because the justice system in America is an imperfect and sluggish piece of antiquated machinery. <laughs> We were in the slammer. Blanche, it's late. There's only one cheesecake left, so let's make menopause the cutoff point. Well, I'll tell you, menopause was wonderful for me. It meant no more PMS. I never had PMS. Neither did I. But I had a BMW. <laughs> a red one. Charlie bought it for me. BMS! You don't have dates on Valentine's Day. Ma, you want to join us? I can't. I have a date. We ought to go out in the kitchen. So we can talk, so we can eat. Better. <laughs> no wonder I'm up in the middle of the night working my way through the cheese keeper. Cheesecake. Cheesecake, Mom. Cheesecake. What kind? Chocolate. <gasps> Cheesecake. 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 I'll get the cheesecake. <laughs> I'll get the whipped cream. I'll get the chocolate syrup. I'll get the Polaroid. This is a time to remember. <laughs> Oh, you don't have a Polaroid. I'll get mine. It's under my bed. I have to go in there for the whipped cream anyway. Oh. Blanche, you're being ridiculous. You are as attractive and desirable as you always were. But a lot of men can be frightened by that. They don't know if they can handle that much woman. So every once in a while, this will happen. Now, Blanche, it takes a strong, confident, sophisticated man to appreciate you. But, honey... They're out there, wanting you as much as you want them. I knew it had to be something like that. Thank you, Dorothy. There really is one born every minute. I wonder who that could be. No, I'm sure it's no one. Hi, it's me, Stan. See, what did I tell you? Because the guy you're with really should be at the controls. <laughs> Just an example. <laughs> Who are you to judge me? I'll put the book on my card, and I want you to know that my card is always current. I come to the library at least three times a week, and my books are always returned promptly during regular library hours, rain or shine. Who are you to judge me? And alone. You are not alone. No, I know I have you guys, but... And I really, I hate myself a little for saying this, but... It felt really sad not to have a man in my life who cares about me. No special guy to wish me happy birthday. No goddamn soulmate. I spoke too soon. <laughs> and I thought you might want to hear about it. You've misjudged me. It was real. He's our mailman. Please, Stan, no hugging, no kissing. Let's just do it and get it over with. Sounds like the last few years of our marriage. <laughs> I wish it was that good. Wait. Okay, okay, I lied. But so what? You never have? Only once, Stanley. The night I told you it was good for me to... Uh. <laughs> <laughs> I used to think Stan would take care of me. I mean, we didn't have much saved, but he was a darn good novelty salesman. Sounds naive now to think that I placed my hopes for the future on a bald pinhead with the morals of a maggot who made his living selling plastic dog do. <laughs> oh. Well, at least I'm not bitter. <laughs> the gentleman at table five in the blue suit is impotent. Bon appetit. <laughs> What was that for? You're not getting into this bed, Stanley. Then where am I supposed to sleep? On the floor like any dog. Oh, fine. <laughs> <laughs> Stanley, if you're doing what I think you're doing, you're in big trouble. Then you leave me no choice. I'll have to pull out the big gun. You're wasting your time, Stanley. I'm familiar with the big gun. I could vomit just looking at you. <laughs> Something... Hard in here. It's a, it's a, it's a scalding hot ring. <laughs> Catherine threw me out. Your wife threw you out? I had no idea she was that bright. 
What happened? Catherine accused me of infidelity. Oh, damn it, Stan. This makes those infidelities during our marriage seem much less special. You think it makes me look more intellectual? Oh, absolutely. By the way, Stanley, your fly is open. No problem, sweetheart. Hurry back, dumpling. My feet have wings, barf bag. <laughs> I'm a salesman. I deal with people all the time. I know exactly what I'm doing. Oh, shut up, Stan. <laughs> Mellow out, Dorothy. Once we get in there, we have to exercise psychological control. That's why I'm wearing this suit. You make me sick. Hey, everyone knows good guys wear white. This suit subliminally tells the auditor I'm a good guy. I could vomit just looking at you. I cannot believe this. I cannot believe that I am hearing this. I mean, I always assumed that something like this could happen, but I just figured it would be with that blonde secretary you had, who couldn't type or take shorthand. You're wrong on two counts, Dorothy. She could take shorthand. And I did have an affair with her. <laughs> I am shocked. That airhead could take shorthand. Bidding at five dollars. Five dollars. One hundred dollars. Stanley, what are you doing here? I'm buying a date with the woman I love. Oh, geez, not in front of people. <laughs> One hundred and ten. What the hell is he doing? Didn't you give him a limit? <laughs> Two hundred. Security, have this man removed. He's a lonely male impersonator. <laughs> Two ten. What is wrong with you? The woman's been with lepers. Three hundred. Stanley, stop it. I am not going out with you. I would rather be bound and gagged and, and left on an anthill covered with honey. Four hundred. Four ten. Sold. Oh, Dorothy, I say that. Five hundred. Sold. She says that. Rose, do something. Sold! More than 10% of it thanks to Dorothy oh, here. Who's keeping score? What's important is that we made a lot of money. I mean, together we made a cons... They were fighting over me. Did you see it? <laughs> well, Dorothy, to be fair, one of them was Stan. Do I sense a tinge of envy there, Miss Going Going Gone for twenty-five fifty? You can't put a price tag on beauty, Dorothy. I'm sure you can. Twenty-five. <laughs> As Big's car drove away, I realized. Having three soulmates already nailed down made it a lot easier to spot those great nice guys to have fun with.